Welcome to beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada, the entertainment capital of the world. But for the next month, Slam Ball is taking over Las Vegas. After 15 years, Slam Ball is back, and we are getting ready for night two of action. Our first game of the night will be the Rumble taking on the Wrath. What's up, everybody? Welcome. Let me join. Joined by my partners, 11-time NBA vet, three-time scoring slam dunk scoring champion. He's Nate Robinson, LaMonica Garrett, who is a former mob member, former scoring leader here in Slam Ball. Guys, night one, we wrapped up after a 15-year hiatus. Nate, what'd you think? Man, straight excitement yesterday was fun. Uh, you know, brought me back from being a kid when I fell in love with Slam Ball. You know, I got a lot of friends and family that watched it. They were like, man, it was so, so much excitement. Uh, you know, yesterday when we, when we had the games. And I'm excited for today. I can't wait. LaMonica, I know you wish you could have been back out there last night. <laughs> my shell says I can still do it, but my ligaments <laughs> in these pipes, they say sit your butt down somewhere. <laughs> but it was good to see it. It's good to be back. We helped build this, and uh, I'm, I'm hyped to see these young players evolve it to even more than what we did. All right, we're going to get more and more fans every night. So to get you caught up, learn the rules, let's take a look at everything you need to know to have fun with tonight with the action. There's a couple scenarios in which hits are illegal. You're allowed to hit as long as it's in the man's front. He cannot be hit in the back. He cannot be hit on the side. There's no hitting or contact of any kind inside the slam zone other than the stopper. And the stopper has to make a play on the ball. If the stopper just pushes the offensive player, they're gonna call a violation on the stopper. Contact on the stopper. The number one foul that we usually have is an offensive player. As soon as he has left the floor to enter the slam zone, the defensive player now has to let up. He cannot lay a hit anymore. And what you're gonna see is defensive players not let up and they're still gonna maintain contact and that's gonna be a violation and a face off every single time. He's got the ball offensively. He's not greenlit to be hit until he takes a dribble. Roughly half of all slam ball players come from a football background. It truly is a hybrid game that involves rules from football, basketball, and hockey. And contact is a huge part of that. that I mean, <laughs> LaMonica was basically calling out guys to just get laid out all last night. You were begging for it. <laughs> that's, why, that's why we're here. Part of it, you want to see the dunks, but I want to see the hits. I like defense yeah. better than offense, so yeah. I'm here for that. It's like going to the hockey, you know, a hockey match. You want to see somebody get clobbered. That's right. Into the, you know, into the glass. It just excites the fans. It gets them going. It gets everybody, you know, riled up. All right, let's take a look at some of the other rules that are important to understand and have fun with all the action tonight here in Slam Ball. This is how we score. Three points for a dunk. Two points for anything else inside the tramp. Three points if you make a shot outside the tramp. That's basically anything on the gold part of the wood. And anything beyond the arc is a four-point shot, 26 and a half feet. Yeah, Nate, need, that's further than an NBA three-pointer. Yeah, we need some Steph Curry's and some, you know, Trey Young's, Dame Lillard's out here. We gotta find them. Game rules, open court contact. As soon as the player puts the ball on the ground, it is open season. You can just lay him out. We don't shoot free throws after a foul. It's called a face-off. The player who's fouled gets the ball. They go up against the player who committed the foul. And if you score, you keep the rock. Goaltending defenders, they can legally goaltend shots from inside the tramp. Anything from outside the tramp, you are not allowed to goaltend. All right, let's get into the action for tonight. We're going to have the Rumble taking on the Wrath. The Rumble had a tough time last night. They got beat up by the mob. But for them, the leading score was Kalon Tippins Hill. He had eight points in that outing. We take a look at some of the highlights for Tippins Hill. Tippin' Hill, number one right there, laying it in. Yeah, when he was scoring, he did a great job. He just needs to be a little bit more aggressive tonight uh, than he was, you know, against the mob. But the mob had some tremendous defense. It was I, I get why it was so difficult for them guys to score. But for him to get eight points was, was, was huge for that team. So the Rumble trying to come off after their first loss yesterday against the mob. They'll be taking on the Wrath. And Ty McGee, LaMonica, he balled out last night. Yeah, he came to play. And, and today, Christian Gray, their number one draft pick, isn't playing. So Ty McGee is really going to have to step up the work. But he didn't only ball yesterday, and he's about to ball today. He's the second overall leading scorer in the league so far. 
So he's 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 showing out. He's showing out. And that was the nastiest dunk for him yeah, last 34. night. Yeah. 34 points. 12 of 27 from the floor. So Ty McGee trying to have back-to-back -back performances. And he has 12 loose balls recovery. He's getting after it. <laughs> yeah, hustle plays. Yeah, 50-50. He's winning those. Take a look. Lights are out here on the court here at Cox Pavilion as we introduce the starters for the Rumble. So Taylon Kippens Hill in the open. There's their leading scorer, Marcus Bradley, Tamirick Fields, and Jatuan Williams. Your coach for the Rumble, Ken Carter. If that face and name looks familiar, because <laughs> yes, that is the real Coach Carter. The movie was based off of that man right there, Ken Carter. the leading scorer for the Wrath. He also started a brawl in practice a couple days ago. He's got a mean streak in him. Watch out for Ty McGee. He'll be joined in the starting four by Sean Stiff, Darius Slade, and Stephen Julian III. Now, important to note, Christian Gray, Trey Landers, out tonight for the Wrath. They picked up a guy off the taxi squad, Ryan Johnson. Now, the taxi squad is four guys who basically practice the entire season, the entire preseason. If somebody gets hurt, you can pick somebody off of the practice squad, the taxi squad. Yeah, they're going to need a lot Head of those coach guys. coach for the RAD, James <laughs> Willis. The taxi service is going to be heavy in rotation. <laughs> <laughs> To get an idea just how popular Slam Ball is, it came back because of social media buzz, people watching it on YouTube. And check out some of the names you were watching last night. Patrick Mahomes said, man, I missed some Slam Ball. Don't we all, Nate? Listen, man, best quarterback in the NFL. Tweets that, yeah, Instagram that, that's pretty, that's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah, future go tweet, man. That's, that's got something to say. Mike Ola Jr., Jalen Brunson. Slam Ball All-Star Weekend. You think the NBA yes, can make that happen? Ooh. We were talking about that Yes, I said they need to add that. That'll be lit. That'll be so much fun to watch. Rumble off to a quick start. So the Rumble start, oh, they dunk a 3 Got nothing him. game. And there he is, Ty McGee with the first dunk for the game for the Rad. Yeah, Mr. McGee, he might be the leading scorer, man, how he's attacking the basket. He's aggressive. You got to do that. Here's Tippins Hill, featured him in the open, and he slams it home. Okay. Yeah. They're going to the stopper. Okay, Rumble. Yeah. Okay, defense, a little defense here. You put it on the ground, you can yeah. lay him uh, out. Good, There's uh, that good hit. Bump. Oh, good bump again. That's right. Oh, he elbowed oh. him. Oh, he has to dribble again? I'm not sure. What, let me see what happened. I think he came in too high. Uh, I think he came in too high. So because we have a foul, we don't shoot free throws. It's our first face-off of the game. Ty McGee, who got hit, he'll be going off against Jaytuan Williams. And it wasn't even close. The stopper didn't even jump. McGee with another dunk. Yeah, McGee gets after it. <laughs> I like his style. And knowing Christian Gray isn't playing tonight, like he's really, he's flipped the switch already. What do you think the biggest adjustment's gonna be from night one to night two, LaMonica? Uh, muscles and soreness and trying to, <laughs> trying to figure out, you know, how to save some, uh, save something in the tank in case you do win and you have to play another game after that. McGee missed the jams. Here's Fields coming the other way. Throws it up to his teammate off the mark. Tippins Hill missed on the cut. Yeah, I see when, you wanna, when, when they wanna throw lobs, they don't throw it. With air, like you got to, you got to put air on it. You can't throw it like a real, yeah. like a regular pass. Can't be a straight shot. Yeah, you got to give him. Ooh, you got to give him opportunity 
to jump up there. Like, uh, oh, almost got that one. Uh, the defense. Look, we have a 20 second shot clock here in Slam Ball. Shot clock's at five. There you go. Don't matter. Tippins Hill throwing it down. The Rumble's offense is clicking a lot better today. Nobody can stop McGee. He's got all 12 points right now for the wrath. I think because he doesn't try to do fancy dunks. He just gets the bucket however it comes. And I think that's why yeah. it's so difficult to stop him. He's pretty much telling the rest of his team, go take a seat. I got this first half. <laughs> he shows his broad for a reason. I can carry this. Now we got a face-off for the rumble. It was McGee who got the foul for wrath. Oh, this is payback right here. And yeah. Williams trying to get payback here. Here we go. It's face-off time. Ooh, oh, the defense. Oh. Yeah. Williams tried to get fancy with it. McGee says, not in my house. What a block. Bodied up the rim. Yeah. His whole back covered the rim. That's how you, that's the textbook block right there. Ooh, oh. So after the face-off, you keep possession, the rumble. Shoot that up. There's no jumpers. There's going to be no jumpers today. <laughs> Tippins Hill tried to throw it in. It hit the rim, so the clock will reset. Shot clock resets to 12. There, there you go, one. Williams, a four-point shot, shot off the mark. A collision on that rebound. Here's My Darius wrestling. Slade, former football player. Oh, good try. Now, he was in the restricted area. Should have been called. You're only allowed to stand on the island. The other part of the black is out, out of bounds. Tip and sail will reset off the glass. Popcorn. Popcorn is when the defender tries to stop your bounce by jumping in the tramp with you at the same time. You cannot do that. We play five-minute running quarters here in Slam Ball. The clock only stops on a face-off or a timeout. Yeah. Can't land on that black part. You cannot land on that black part. Only the middle part, which is called the island, so that's a travel. You get back on D. Here's the cutter. And the lay-in goes. How to get a bucket. In the tramp without a dunk, that's two points. Darius Slade coming the other way, full head of steam, throws it off the window, no good. Man, Ty McGee has been everywhere tonight, yeah. Nate. Yeah, be he's he's an all-around player. <laughs> but he does that the best, though. Score a bucket. He gets a bucket. He gets after it. Ty McGee has all 17 points oh. for the wrath. And what a good stop right there by Sean Stiff. He says, throw it up. Slade oh. says, I'm going to throw Both it in. jumped in there. Yeah. <laughs> he thought he was going to throw the lob. He got caught in there. That's that timing. So a violation because two Wrath players were in the tramp at the same time. You can't do that. Turnover to the Rumble. Shot from the corner. That would have been a three. Air ball. Under a minute to play here in this first quarter. Man, it is just too easy for Ty McGee. But when they run their offense through other people, ooh, that was close. The defense. The Wrath offense isn't really clicking, but if you have a Ty McGee on your team, it makes up for a lot of mistakes. Taken off from the outside tramp. McGee with another jam. He got 22 points. He got 22 in the first. That's crazy. Is there? Is that a slam ball record? That's got to be something. That's got to be a slam ball yeah. record. We got to look that up. Can y'all get the stat on that? Here comes Julian. Got him. Projected by the rim. Eight seconds to play here in the quarter. Tippins Hill. Kick out for the four-pointer. Washington, no. Decides to fake out the D. And he faked out himself. You got to take that shot. In the quarter. The great quarter for Tom McGee. Yes. Ty McGee says, you got to learn this name, Nate. Yeah, you love this game. If you're, if you're, if you're a fan you're watching right Slam Ball right now, and you love people that get buckets, this should be your number one guy.
It is a packed house inside Cox Pavilion for night two of action as the Wrath lead the Rumble right now, 22 to 14. John Schriff and Nate Robinson, LaMonica Garrett on the call. Ty McGee has all 22 points for the Wrath. LaMonica, have you ever seen that before? I have not. And more importantly, the defense, I'm a defensive-minded guy. If I'm seeing one guy doing all this damage to me, I'm rounding up the guys and saying he's not going to beat us, not tonight. I would put two on him and let the rest of the team take over if they need to. Yeah, we still need that stat. It's got to be a record. Tip his hill, denied at the rim. Sean man. Stiff with the huge block. The blocker, man, he, hey, man, they don't get enough credit. Hey, yeah. He is locking that rim down. Maybe Shaq over there. Uh. Steven Julian, the first bucket for someone not named Ty McGee for the rap. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, great stop and play. Here's the three by Richard Washington. Excuse me, the four. They kick out to him. This is a three from the gold part of the hardwood, and he makes okay, it count. There you go. Now you're playing some basketball. That's basically the equivalent to a high school three-pointer, Nate. Yeah, they just need to go ahead and shoot some more of these fours and threes because, you know, you can't always get to the basket and dunk. Oh, off the, oh, the, McGee. Off the trampoline. He's oh, yeah. showing his mid-range game out yeah. here. Hey, listen, he's going for 50 tonight. He's nice. going for the record. Tip and tail. With the easy dunk, faked out the stopper. When you're going down in the tramp and you see the offensive player going up, that's a bad feeling around that rim. Oh, they call that Frenzo, baby foul? Yeah. Zero. Reach and foul on the stopper. Fields. So we're going to have a face off. Ty McGee. All right, Ty McGee has levels to his dunks. What's the key if you're the stopper, LaMonica, to stopping this face off? He's going to get the ball and go quick. Ah. And, and then he switched it up. Yeah, and then he switched it up. The defender knew he was going to go quick, so he matched him. And they both slowed down before they hit that last jump in midair. And he up barely didn't get to the rim. He threw it in for two, but still, that's two points. So Tom McGee with a little change up, giving the rat oh, a nine oh, point oh. lead. Jump ball. They get defense. physical out here. I like this. Defense. Nate, defense, get it. So the Rumble get the ball down by nine with this running clock here in the second quarter. Alley you from half court. Oh. I'd go straight to. Oh, good block. I would let them beat me. I would not let Ty McGee. On a fast break, I'd go hit Ty McGee straight off the wall. Here's the kick out. Richard Washington off the mark. See the, the tip of your putbacks. Yeah. That's what I, I mean. Look, oh, four. Tipped up. Oh, oh there you go. Richard Washington. You got to be in. able to do that. You got to be able to take some shots because you can't make them all, but then you got rebounds. Oh, good lob. Great lob. Darius Slade. Slade, and then oh, he tried to get him over, but he took the worst of that one. Oh! oh. Tamrick Field. Went coast to coast. Oh. He did not now like getting playing. dunked yeah, on. Yeah, there we go. Now you playing. And McGee, because he took off, you could not touch him. There's a foul. I'm playing with me, he said. What side you want, man? That was Fields, the stopper, getting in on the offensive end. But he laid down a hit before he got in there, yeah, too. Yeah, ran him over. <laughs> Because that was the second foul, we only have one face-off per quarter per team. Two points to the ref, and they get the ball back. They're in the bonus. We're in the double bonus after the fourth foul. It'll be three points and the ball. McGee from the island. Resets. There you go. Puts it up off the window. Back to himself, and he goes in. Two more for Ty McGee. He got McGee's 30. up to 28 points. Dang, 28. He got more points than their whole team. The live throwing skills is not uh, up to par. Yeah. <laughs> Washington from the corner. That's a three off the mark. Rebound goes to the wrap. Somebody's got to hit this man, man. For real, they got to slow him down. Yeah. And he's another fouled on the way up. So, Nate, you called it, man. Another two points. That's two the third he's foul of the quarter. 50. He might have the record. LaMonica, how do you take one guy out of the offense if you're the de that defensive team to rumble here? Whatever their, whoever their best defensive player is, you take that challenge upon yourself. 
whenever you yeah. see him standing around, you just go hit him. Two. Go put hands on him. Two. Two of the tramp. Turnover. Goes to the rumble. Here's Tippins Hill. Resets into the bottom tramp. Tipped away by the stopper. Rumble still have it. Shot box at 10. Two in the tramp and the rumble. Got to have better communication on offense. Yeah, this is where you need that one defender on your team that takes the responsibility to say, he's mine. Nobody else gets him. He's, he's me. Who's that dude in the NBA, Nate? Best defender you ever played against? Oh, man, that I ever played against? Uh, I mean, watching... Well, Ron Artest was really, you know, he was really playing defense and really, you know, playing basketball. He was a tough defender. Okay. Um, who, who's who's going to be the best Lindsay Hunter? Hunter? Lindsey Hunter was a great defender for guards. Okay. People hated when he was out the court. Nice Lindsay alley there. Was a, he, was a, he was a badass. Nice. That's my language. <laughs> Good. Thirty seconds to play here in this first half. Washington, and they are not timing the alley oops right now in this first half. Here comes the cutter. This is the stopper. Fields resets in the bottom tramp. Kick out. Three on the shot clock. Someone's got to get it up. Washington for four. Here's Ryan Johnson. Just picked up off the taxi squad. His first action here in slam ball. And that'll do it for the first half. <laughs> I, I understand you don't agree with it, but don't right come right all yeah. I understand. Hey, look, I understand. Ten point lead for the Wrath, and it was Ty McGee taking over. Yeah, he went nuts. Take a look at some of the first half highlights. The Wrath getting all over it. A 10-point lead over the Rumble. We'll be back to Vegas after this. Can you guys hear us in the truck? Welcome back. Halftime here on night two. Here is Slam Ball. Take a look at some of the highlights in the first half of action. I'm guessing we're going to see Ty McGee in some of these highlights with a wrap with a 38-28 lead. And here he is, number 21. It's going to be all him. <laughs> Nate, McGee had 26 points in that first half. Yeah, they got to figure out a way how to stop him because, uh, and like, we in the NBA. And you got guys like Dan and Kobe that get buckets. You got double team him. Yeah. Yeah, you got to put a body on him. Maybe two bodies. He should never be left standing alone anywhere on the court. And for the rumble, Kalon Tippins Hill at six foot seven was getting in as well as Tamiric Fields. Let's take a look at the leading scores for both squads. McGee with 28. And Tippins Hill with 15. I don't understand. How do you slow this guy down? Because he's Man, been doing it. You got to have one of your one of your one of your muscles. Yeah. <laughs> one of your muscles get him. When he put that ball on the ground, you got to you got to lay some lumber to him. And even when he's not around the ball, when he's just standing off the ball somewhere, you got to go put a hat on. Yeah, him. facts. Slow him down. Get him tired. Something we have seen for the first time, Nate. Guys taking shots from outside the trance. We've seen the rumble yeah, attempt about some time. threes and some fours. Yeah, you said that's what you have to do sometimes because. They have so many empty possessions. And you're at the rim, and the stopper, and the Raph stopper is doing a great job. So I would just neutralize him by shooting and trying to make threes and fours. Rumble came to play, though. They look a lot better this, this, uh, this second time out. So this is the first game tonight. We have another game coming up next after us. So we take a look at our bracket for this session. 
Coming up next will be the Ozone taking on the Lava. The winner of both games will move on to the main event tonight. If you win the main event tonight, it is important because when we start seeding for the playoffs, the more main event wins you have, that'll differentiate you when it comes to the tiebreakers. It might mean a team who makes or misses the playoffs depending on how many main event wins you got. Yeah, you, you definitely need the wins because uh, it's going to add up and you don't want to be left out. There's James Willis, three-time champion in slam ball when he was a player. Now he's the coach at the RAF. And the rumble with the throwdown. Get the ball first here to start this third quarter. Here's Tippins Hill. Resets, throws it down. Nice. Set play. Good set play. So you put a body on. So because he didn't touch the rim, it's only a two-pointer. From the island, Ty McGee trying to find a teammate. Oh, yeah, he travels that you got to throw off the wall. Let's go, man. Let's go. <laughs> he totally forgot that. Let's go. See what adjustments the rumble is going to make try to do. He's playing unconscious. There's McGee with the loose ball with the outlet to Steven Julian. And he's going to foul him, foul him. Don't be scared. Yeah. He was like in between of, do yeah. I hit him or not? You better try to take his head off. You can't go in there on uh, eggshells. Steven Julian at six foot seven. He'll have the rock on the faceoff. Face and he'll go against six foot seven, Kalon Tippins Hill. Nate Collin, who do you think wins this battle right here? Oh man, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say stopper. Okay, okay. Here we go. They're gonna meet at the top. Yeah, they're oh, gonna meet. Oh, Nate called it. Hey, yeah. listen. He I, hey, it. I'm about to go to the tables. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go to the table that You're wasting your talents here. You need to be at that table. <laughs> Here's the replay. Oh, Tippins Hill. Nate's guy came through. Yeah, McGee tried to throw it off the backboard himself. An eight-point lead for the Wrath here in this third quarter. Good pass. Nice another pass. Got him. Hill. Another bucket. Got him. Yeah. Trent. He's yeah. too easy. Today. He got like 22. He's having a great game. It's just being overshadowed by Ty McGee. Like, oh, there you go. Yeah, Smack him. Oh, oh, he's getting hit him again. Now. There you go. Slade in the bottom tramp. And one. What, what just happened? The foul was called, and because that's the second personal foul, two points for the wrath, yep. and they keep the ball. Mm. Top four, you are not Oh, so they call it a popcorn there. Counts as a as a foul. You can't keep him from getting in. And you can't throw him. Look, this ain't basketball. You, you, no, no. Oh, still. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. It's going to be a one collision. On one. Here's Fields. Missed oh, he didn't get jump. that jump. Yeah. He jumped too close to the, uh, too deep. Yeah, too, too deep on the Got him. Mm, oh, good block. Oh. Sean Stiff, and they're going to call a foul. He came out there. Like I thought he was going to take man. off right. He would, he, if he had gotten that X. McGee on the island. Finds a cutter. Off the nice. window, Steven Julian. That's two points. Yeah. It's almost like the stopper is trying to kill your bounds and he's willing to give you that two-point play, but not the dunk. Tipped away, stays with the rumble. Washington launches the four off the rebound. Board. Look, rebound. There's the ah, there tip. it is. Like you know, what I'm saying like you're gonna miss those sometimes, and then you gotta get the rebound, the putback dunk. And what I've noticed, the rumble, I've noticed the rumble doing every time someone shoots that three, they send someone in in case it comes off the rim for the putback. Every time. Wow, they're all over McGee this quarter. They have to. Way to change it up. Williams with the kick out, Washington on oh, top of the oh, yeah. key. Here's Fields for four. Give me one. Ah. Oh, shoot it again. Big jump into the traps. Oh. On Tim his head. Head. Fields with the yeah. facial. Put him in a body bag. Now we're playing. Uh, they came back down too. Ah, left uh -oh. it over. Easy bucket. Ty McGee's got three more. He's up to 31. Nice. That's his first points of the second half. And we only got a minute left to go in the third. Yeah, he. Yeah, they're putting the body on him. Good move. You can hit him here. You can hit him. If you want to go in, he can go in. 
four. Uh, was it four? Kick That's out. Four. That's Williams. Oh, yeah. There you go. Look, they yep. playing up. You know what I'm saying? There you go. This is Rumble it's a basketball real basketball right playing right now. Oh, good hit. Uh, good stop. Great stop of play. You could tell Coach Carter made some adjustments at the half because the rumble looks did. completely different right now. Uh, That'll be a three, three from the corner. Yep, Washington, oh, rebound. And Look, shoot it again. Get it right oh, back oh, to him. Shot it again. Got him. Oh, uh, good defense. That's good hands right there. That's the stopper, Sean Stiff. Slade lays oh. it up. Oh, he tried it. That was nice. Kick out to the leading scorer, Tom McGee. Running start at the rim, yeah. throws it down. He's got 34 points. Oh, man. Shot clock's going to continue Eight, to run. Seven. Man, just six. Five, take the four. Take the four. Three take seconds the four. on the shot clock. Take the four. That's a shot clock violation. Didn't uh, even get it oh, off. Oh, he got it off. Okay. That's a good shot. Oh, good pass. pass. Oh, oh Steven yeah. Julian off the tip assist from Darian Slade. Nice. When you that bring was a that, nice, that was yeah, a nice quarter. You bring that stopper up on offense, you just, you're susceptible to that easy dunk in the back. Yeah, what a quarter. The Rumble making it interesting. Kaylon Tippins Hill, six foot seven, throwing it down. And the stopper getting in the fields. One more. Oh. Great game. Look at this crowd here in Las Vegas. There's swag surfing right uh -huh. now as we get ready to start this fourth quarter. Nate Robinson, LaMonica Garrett, John Schriffen on the call. Okay, we see your moves. That third quarter was something special. That was one of the best quarters we've seen so far in slam ball. Yes, yeah. it was very competitive. Very yeah. competitive quarter, and uh, it's good to see Coach Carter make adjustments and his team actually listen. Both teams were highly efficient in that third quarter. Mid-range jumper. You can oh. block it from inside the tramp. Sean nice. Stiff, the stopper. He blocking that. He blocking that. He blocking that. Oh. Block. Yeah, Ooh. I saw that. Back-to-back -back blocks. We're going to see some collisions here in this fourth quarter. Kalen Tippins Hill with the kick out. Oh, yeah. Jayton Williams, too strong with the jumper. Yeah, I like that they're taking jumpers, though. Oh, oh. Good, uh, another good stop. Myrick feels the stopper for the rumble, pounds his chest. Got him. Yes, yep, he yeah. can do nothing about that. He got like 20, 24, 26. Yeah, he's, he's having a heck of a game. Nice game today. Oh, yep, good defense. Give me those. Pull up. Oh, I'm pulling up, right? I'm sorry, I'm thinking it's the NBA. <laughs> <laughs> I would have pulled up three in transition after that steal. <laughs> and look at him, fourth quarter play. McGee makes an adjustment in the air, but oh, the stopper, stopper. Oh. He, 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 bounced. Yeah, he hit bounced on the backboard. Himself. <laughs> he hit himself on the backboard. Yeah. That was hilarious. Too much bounce. <laughs> These aren't your normal tramps. Look, he's laughing. These are he's Olympic, Olympic <laughs> grand tramps. <laughs> Look at this. Look, he bounced himself on the backboard. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> them bunnies, man. Still getting used to them bunnies. All right, Mr. Fields. Last lead is down to oh, five. Oh, here we go. Uh oh. Uh, uh, get back on D. The stopper's out of position. Oh, good defense. Steven Julian, can he take advantage? Yes, he does, plus the foul. Oh, that one, that was nice. So two points for Julian. And a face off? I think they gave him the points. They gave oh, okay. him the points, so the Rumble will get the ball. Three minutes to play in the ball game. Stop. That's he, why he's a stopper. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, def, you definitely need somebody that can pass like Pistol Pete. <laughs> timeout. Timeout. So a timeout charge for the wrath as James Willis, head coach, wants to talk things over. LaMonico, what do you think the wrath want to talk about here with the lead here in the fourth quarter? Uh, I, think I think Champ might be trying to slow the game down a little bit. Okay. They got time. They got the lead. This could happen fast. And then we have, remember, in the fourth quarter, they could take fouls and just block them on face-offs to try to keep getting the ball back. So 
They're, they're talking That's strategy smart. right now. Yeah. yeah. They're coaching them up. All right. Look at them. Look both of the coaches. All right. If you're the Rumble and Coach Carter, Nate, how do the Rumble get back in this one in the fourth? They have to make shots and get stops. That's what it's about. At the end of the day, when you're down and you're trying to come back, you got you to get buckets and you got to play the stop game. Two stops at a time. Coach Carter got in their faces and questioned all of them. Their pride, like, this is not this is not a Coach Carter team. We're the Rumble, and he's telling them that right now, like, it's time to come out and play. 2.48 to play in the ball game. Winner will play the winner of our next game, Ozone versus Lava. And then we have the main event later tonight. Classic. Shout out to the DJ. You guys understand he's playing some classic yeah. hits. Playing hits. If you're in Vegas, head to slamballleague.com to buy your tickets. This is a party here in Las Vegas. Steven Julian enters the bottom tramp. Contested shot. Trying to get the rebound. Tips it out. Oh, man. McGee directing traffic. Gets the clear out dunk. They call that a wing cut. On okay. the side to the bottom. McGee can pretty much score from anywhere on the floor. Tippins Hill. Yeah, good shot. There's a three-point shot for Williams, yeah, and that falls down. Need. He's he's their guy. He's that, he's that guy for that shot. Williams is now in double figures. He's Hit. got ten. Hit. McGee on the island. Got to release him when you go from one position to the next, so a turnover. Under two minutes to play. Rumble needs to start looking at the clock. Here's Fields, the stopper. Oh! oh. Big body slam. Stopper on stopper. Oh, he failed. He failed. Uh -oh. Got to get up. What do you call that? Footwork. <laughs> footwork. You got to get your footwork right. Oh. Footwork. Oh, yeah. yeah they're coming back. Cramp. Here we go. Bang on him. Feels he reminds me your of, head. He reminds me of an old school player that played in my day, uh, Anthony White. Big A White used to come down, big tall dude like that, and just it was hard to stop him. Washington three is off the mark. Loose ball. Who's coming away with it? Look oh, at that. Pass. The hustle. hustle from the rumble. Huh. Cross court pass. Ah, those, those never work. Yeah. Never make a cross court pass. He don't want to dribble to get hit. That's why he passes. He right, yeah. hit. Here's McGee with the kick out. One minute in the ball game. Got to reset when you uh, lead the, the trade. Oh. They caught that foul. You cannot slam them face first into the boards. Let them oh, play, okay. man. <laughs> Let, I would, hey, I would <laughs> act like I didn't see it. I would act like I didn't see it. I didn't see it. You know, I ain't calling that. Let them play, ref. <laughs> a minute left. So a legal contact is called. Here it is again. Oh, he didn't even. Yeah, that man, was nothing. He was already falling forward from the trampoline, taking him too far to the to the uh, to the grass. Yeah, got to let him play on that one. That's hustling. They should be rewarded for hustling. That means we're gonna have a face-off. Darian Slade, who got slammed into the wall, he'll have the ball. He's going up against the stopper to Myrick Fields. I like Fields on this one. Okay. Okay. Call that. Well played. Nate's Nate's a perfect one for one tonight. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, let me see. Let me see what my spider my spider sense is tingling. All right. So the stopper to Myrick Fields is six foot seven. Darian Slade's a handler, six foot. I mean, speed kills. Like I said, if you get there faster than the guy, then you're gonna win. But I don't think I don't think my man Fields is giving up this bucket. Okay, so you guys I'm are both going go with field. the stop. Yeah, right. you got to. The, the, to the, offensive player, the offensive player got the advantage on this anyway, usually. There we go. It's face-off time. Darian Slade trying to fake out the stopper. Here he goes. One-on-one. -on -one. Oh, oh would have been wrong. The little man Tell gets the slam. Speed kills, man. Speed kills. Yeah, Monica, nice. Slade was already in the air before the stopper even entered the tram. Yeah, that first step, man. If that if you don't match his first step, you're dead in the water. Oh. 
And that could be lights That's out. That's game over. Ty yeah. McGee with the jam. Three more. That's it. McGee, he's got a 40 piece tonight. There's a four point shot. Oh, that's a win. Kick Good out. Pass. Shoot that. Oh, got him. You're taking too much time. You're taking, look, you're, you're missing those. You might as well yeah. miss a four pointer. What's the difference? There's a kick out on the wing. Jayton Williams gives it up to Washington. Oh, in and out. Yeah, I'm, I'd rather miss those than anything else. McGee. Uh, oh, he's padding his stats 42. now. He's padding his stats. That's nice. Too little, too late. Yeah, too little, too late, but 42 is a nice show out. There you go. The wrap. Nice. On night two, get the win. 65-55 over the Rumble. Leading score, Ty McGee. 43 points, LaMonica. Yeah, that's impressive. You don't see that too much. As I'm saying, can we get the stat, guys? What's it is official, stat, Nate. Man? It is a slam ball record, 43 I'm points, an all-time high. That's mm. what's up. Well played, Ty McGee. Well played. Yeah, way to put your name in, there, in the history books. The next two teams are already taking the court, warming up. It'll be the Ozone taking on the Lava. Winner of the game next will take on the Wrath. Ty McGee finished with 43 points, and he had it going early on. He is joined now by the fourth member of our team, Sean Jackson, a.k.a. Inches, another slam ball legend, has Ty McGee. Wow, wonderful game. Exciting you. game, man. Thank How'd you, you like it? Man, it was good. Uh, missing Debo out there for sure, but the squad stepped up. Uh, Slim was great today. The whole squad hustling. Uh, that's more like it today for us. All-time high, 43 yes, points. Yes, sir. What do you think? You know what? Uh, we got another one tonight. I'm going to try to come out and execute again. Man, nice. wonderful, wonderful. Hey, my man, my man. All right, Inches, appreciate no, that. Don't even hang him. 43 points. There we go. <laughs> Don't hang him. There we go. Dap him up now. He just got 43, man. You can't leave him out of the Strong for love. Yeah. <laughs> it was one point. When McGee was outscoring the Rumble all by himself, Nate, in that first quarter. Yeah, yeah that first quarter was tough. They couldn't, they, they couldn't stop him. They had, they, had, they had no answers for him, so they did a good job in the second half. All right, we're going to step aside here as the next two teams warm up. You're looking at the Sphere, the newest attraction on the Strip. Well, we got Slam Ball. That's the biggest attraction right now. 